Welcome everyone to another edition of the Highball Advisors Railroad Retirement Mailbag. My name is John McNamara of Highball Advisors, and today's question comes in from Andrew. And Andrew asks, okay, so to clarify that I'm understanding this correctly, I'll have 30 years of service at 51 years old. Am I correct in thinking that I can step away from the railroad at 51 with 30 years of service, just sit on my butt, uh, granted, I have enough accessible money until I turn 60 and then receive my full retirement benefits. Thanks. Is uh, So, congratulations, first of all, 30 years at 51, tremendous achievement. So, yes, if you don't, uh, you will always, even if you go to work, you will always receive your full service and age benefits for annuity. What we're talking about is the survivor annuity, right? So, if you, in between those years, you go back to work on a W-2 position, then you're sacrificing your uh, survivor annuity. So, and then really great job understanding that importance of that income bridge to get to the 60. So well done on that. So check out my video, how to build a bridge to early railroad retirement. And that will help you build that bridge to retirement. All right. So railroaders, send in your questions. I'll shoot a video on them. Until next time, everyone, please stay safe, stay on track, and take care. So long, everybody. Bye.